Yellowstone National Park has too many geysers and hot springs. Um, and out of all of them, there's three main ones. There are ones that look like they'd be really nice to sit in, like a cool hot tub. Um, there are ones that, I guess, you know, shoot water really high. Um, and then there are the ones that look like chocolate milk and they smell really bad. And I've got to warn you, I am an expert on Yellowstone hot springs and geysers because I went there once. So you have to take my word for it. So starting off, just the ones that look cool. This one, um, it's called Canary Spring. Looks beautiful. Water's just flowing over, got some steam coming off of it. Cool as hell. Next up, Pallet Spring. Look at that water flowing over the edge. That's awesome. How can you beat that? Now we're at the ones that I would want to sit in, or at least it looks like I'd want to sit in them. Uh, that one's the painted pool. This one, I don't remember what it was called, but like, look at that. You, how would you, it looks like a hot tub. This one's really cool though, because it had those bubbles that just never come to the surface. Um, this one's arrowhead pool. That looks pretty dope. It's got these bubbles around. It's like the jets are on. Uh, this one's called like f uh, fishing cove. This one's Old Faithful, unlike my ex-wife. We're not in the ones that you'd want to sit in anymore. That probably wouldn't be too fun. Uh, Old Faithful is just a classic though. Everyone knows it. Throws water really high. Pretty cool stuff. All right, next up, the ones that look like chocolate milk and smell terrible. This is Mud Volcano. It's not really a volcano, but it's got a lot of mud in it. And they smell like sulfur. They're terrible. But yeah, they're like thick. This is the Mud Cauldron, uh, kind of less thick. Uh, churning cauldron, um, very steamy, smelled like a wet fart, and it's called the paint pots because it's, you know, it looks like a little pot of paint. It's just a small one though. This next one, it's a fumarole, it's a triple threat, it's big, steamy, smells bad, and it throws shit everywhere. And then the silver globe geyser is like the arch nemesis, it just looks cool, it's a little bit angsty, it throws water, it doesn't hurt anyone. Um, but yeah, those are all of the geysers of Yellowstone. That's all of them.